Okay. What? Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Jessica, the Dancing Avon Lady, and today we are trying out one of my first PR gifted products from Avon Canada, and that is this. This is the Jeju Aloe Fresh Ice Soothing Face Mask. So this product, I did show you the unboxing of it in my last video, but I didn't actually test it. So I've never tried this particular product before, so this is definitely gonna be a first impressions video, but you guys know that I love my sheet mask. I do have a slight sheet mask addiction. Yeah, totally. And this is not even half of them. <laughs> They're all hidden. In that drawer. So this particular one, it's uh, formulated with aloe that is grown in the Jeju Island. Again, I don't know if I'm pronouncing that correct, but I think it just sounds fancier, so that's how we're pronouncing it for this video. Correct me though, please do correct me <laughs> in the comment section if I am pronouncing this wrong. So this is formulated with aloe vera leaf extract from the Jeju Islands, like I said, and the Jeju Islands is known for according to the Nature Collections website, it's known for the uh, fertile volcanic soil and its lush plants life. It is located to the south of the Korean Peninsula. So as you know, Avon is in collaboration with LG and under that umbrella, we do carry brands such as Nature's Collections, Face Shop, VDL, Belief, etc. Et this is exciting because this is part of the Nature's Collection. This particular product here is made in Korea. And the fun thing about this is that you can stick this in the fridge. It's actually formulated to be stuck in the fridge for an extra icy cooling effect on those hot summer days. Funny enough, it's a cold day today. I'm that's why I'm like in long sleeves. I had on a short sleeve. I'm like, oh my gosh, I am freezing. But we're gonna get extra chilly willy today with this beautiful baby here because I really want to try it. The other thing is that I did do a poll, uh, my first poll on TikTok, Insta, and my Facebook stories, and. Um, it was really interesting. It was kind of like the battle between Facebook and Instagram. So on Facebook, they really wanted me to try the mask, but on Insta, you guys really wanted me to try the serum. So eventually, like Pam said, we're gonna try both. Anyways, you guys know me, I just love trying products. It's just fun. Let's go back to the fridge thing. So if you stick this in the fridge, please note that approximately after 40 minutes, this baby will be frozen solid, like, rock hard in that case you'll be able to mold it to your face it literally be like trying to take a piece of paper but firm paper if you like taking i don't know one of these fact sheets and smack it on my face and trying to make a face mask out of it i don't feel the effects <laughs> that's what it'd be like so don't do that if you happen to put it in your fridge and it becomes rock hard so frozen solid essentially you want to take it out let it sit in room temperature for approximately 10 minutes until it is soft and pliable, like so. If you can't do this, no buenos. If there's extra serum in here, if you have, if you did experience going outside, getting a bit too much sun, I would suggest to put it on like other areas of your body, let's say your shoulders, neck, maybe even your scalp. I never thought of putting it on my scalp. But you know, we never sunscreen our scalp line. But mine is like, pasty white right now but anyways yeah or like your chest area anywhere where you received a little bit too much sun you can put this on too it is beneficial for a after sun treatment like we say it also helps to prevent dryness caused by sun exposure there is a three-in-one benefit to this including moisturization soothing and cooling and so you know what i wonder if this would be good for people who experience hot flashes Maybe. It's also suitable for all skin types, but it's best for dry and sensitive skin. All right, my skin lately has been having a hissy fit, like temper tantrum on my face. Look at that. I don't know if it's hormones like Tom's coming or something, but check this out, check this out, and check this out. Actually, I think my nose one now, guys, I've been redoing a little bit more research. It could be because my glasses are too heavy, but I can't change my glasses because I love these and I, my insurance won't cover another pair. <laughs> For two years but it hurts and I've been trying to squeeze these to to fix it but if you have any suggestions to get my glasses to stop tying down my face let me know but I love these glasses so I'm not changing them but yes my skin has been having a pissy fit temper tantrum flow bold like my almost two-year-old on my face I haven't changed my skincare routine but I've been really stressed out so maybe that's it could be that could be hormones 
who knows i am counting on you to calm the temper tantrum that's going on my face it also says that it instantly absorbs the skin without leaving any sticky residue behind oh, that is good it delivers ultimate hydration by forming a moisture barrier it's also vegan and then also free from parabens tax tar colors wow mineral oil and I don't know how to pronounce that, guys. Benzophenone. Benzophenones? We'll try that. Dash three. To use this, you're going to wash your face, which I did, but I am going to use my favorite micellar water. I just opened up a brand new bottle to make sure that everything is good. If this could remove my pimples, that would be amazeballs. So this micellar water, you do not have to rinse it or anything. Now I'm going to use my toner. Actually, you know what? The Dr. Batmore one probably would help my pimples. I really need to get on that one. Oh, I just need to... I need time to film. Because I want to show you everything. I want to share everything with you. I'm in a weird mood today, guys. I got sleep. I'm crazy when I sleep. I'm crazy when I don't sleep. I think I just need to come to terms with the fact that I'm just a little loopy. All right, toner's on. I'm gonna let that set in. I'm gonna stick my hair in a headband. When I asked a few people why they wanted me to try the face mask first, it's because of a couple reasons. One, it just makes most sense because then my face is ready uh, and I don't have to wait two weeks to try this after. Because you guys know, I usually try out new skincare products for two weeks, which would be the serum. And then also another thing is someone wanted to know if it reduces puffiness which is jody and i don't think my eyes are insanely puffy but hey i could always use some deflating 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 and then nancy wanted to know how it affects sensitive skin is it jelly so what's the texture like is it good for dry skin and how cooling is it and how does it make my skin feel versus other masks all right now i gotta remember stuff actually you know what when i smile you do have some bags Maybe I am more tired than I thought. Here we go. You open up the package and then you put it on your face and you let it sit for 10 minutes. I usually actually do my face mask for 15 to 20 minutes. And I think I've said this before, I have friends who do it overnight. I don't know how she does it because my face mask would literally probably be end up by my feet because I move so much in my bed while I'm sleeping. Or Kiwi, my dog, would have licked it all off. He's like, mm, yum, yum, yum. I love mommy, yummy, yummy. Let's try this out. So, opening up. Oh, interesting. First impressions of the scent. It reminds me a lot of the uh, first thing that popped in my head was belief. Don't know why. It's not exactly like belief, but it has a really nice, lightly citrusy scent that belief has. That's just very light and fresh. That's the first thing that came to my head. Pulling this baby out. At first I was like, why does it feel so stiff? It's because it has the paper okay what i'm so confused whoa what what i don't get this wait oh ha, that's so cool there's a top part and a bottom part it's a bikini mask that's so awesome oh I, this is my first time ever using a mask like that it's not bikini season for my body yet so i'm gonna put it on my face i usually go bottom top so we're gonna do that today so here it is. So it's just literally folded in half. Ooh, the texture is so interesting. Wait, what? Oh, oh my gosh. This is like maximum security bodyguard type of a thing. Be yeah. Oh, wait, no. Silly Jess. Because there's like, it's a two layer film because it was folded like this and I was just expecting to open it and then for it to have the mask right away. But there's another layer of plastic protection right here, like so, but it happened to have folded over. So I thought it was like two layers of plastic plus then it's the mask and then another layer. I was like, whoa, that's just way too much. Wow, so interesting. So you can see that it's kind of, instead of a serum-y mask, this is actually more creamy. So I wonder if this will end up staying on your face longer. Okay, I'm gonna carefully put this aside somewhere and then we'll use the rest of that on my chest. Okay, so here it is. Chin to mouth. Okay, once it's on, it's cooling, guys. Like, it feels cold. It is really thick. Like, the texture of this is much thicker than what I'm used to. Ladies and gentlemen, this is what I would look like with a beard. I'm going to put it right against the nose nasally area. But look at how easy this is staying on, though, guys. That's impressive. Here's the top part. 
At first, I thought that wasn't a lot of extra product because I could normally squeeze out some from the pouch. But it's all stuck onto the film, so which is great because then I don't need to squeeze it like a ketchup package. Once I take it out of the package, the scent is a little bit more earthy. I'm trying really hard not to get that in my eye. In my eye would not be good. Better. All right. Wow, it sticks on my face really easily, which is good. It actually sticks on better than the other one that I tried, the tea tree oil one. I didn't do a video on that, but I did that during one of our happy hour events, uh, like a sheet mask night for Mother's Day. Well, this is really scary looking, isn't it? If you haven't yet though, join our happy hour with Avon page on Facebook. We meet every Friday to chit chat. So now we're going to let it work. I am going to frugally take all of this extra stuff here. Stick it all over my chest. Look at all that. Wow. These are a lot of products. You know, if you really wanted to, you could fold it up, put it in the pack back in the package, stick it in the fridge, and use the rest of this like a night cream or something. There's like nothing left inside the actual package, so it's all here. So I would, if you want to be like super frugal or like get extra mileage out of your product, I think, and don't quote me on this, your mileage may vary and to each their own. You can always try putting this after you open it, stick in the fridge and use it that night for another layer of moisturization. I'm going to wait 10 minutes and I'll be back. All right. It's now actually been about 15 to 18 minutes and I am ready to take this off. Now, before we get into the actual opinion stuff, note that yes, this was a PR gifted sample from Avon. Thank you again, Avon. <laughs> I can't take myself seriously with this mask on, but all opinions are my own, my friends. First thing that I did notice is that um, the cooling effect I do feel more on my face than what I put on my chest. I think it's because it's also, this is more saturated, like the sheet mask itself is more saturated. So there's definitely going to be more products there. And also it's helping the product stay on my face as opposed to being evaporated out right away. I don't know. That's just a thought, whether or not that's scientifically true. Who well, knows? You probably might know. And if that is the case, let me know. And it's still cooling. Like I still feel my cheeks being cooled. Not as much on my forehead. The other possible theory is that the skin on my chest and my neck is probably thicker than, well, yes, it's going to be thicker than what's on my face. So it can, I just, your, your face is more sensitive. Okay, so let's peel this off. Here we go. Hmm. Oh, the pimple's still there. Wishful thinking. So this garbage only one time use. Now what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to pat it all in. I usually do this. I can't pat forever. I know it's supposed to help, but I can't do this forever. I do it under my eyes and it helps to like reduce some of the dark circles under your eyes. So I'll do it under my eye area. Yeah, my face feels cold. Like literally it feels cold. Like imagine on a hot summer day, how amazing. If you don't have AC, you need to plaster this all over your body. I'll help keep you cold. I'm going to try to pat. I usually massage it in like this. I'll pat because that's what it says to do. Now, there is also a warning on the packaging that if you're allergic to adhesive bandages, don't use this product. Translation, I put a little bit on my lips. Let's do the puffy under eye test. It's still kind of puffy. It didn't say that it's going to reduce swelling, but it did feel cold. And the other thing is also that you don't actually put it on your eyes. So my eyes were open the entire time. If you do want something um, to help with your your the puffiness on your eyes, you can always take two tablespoons or teaspoons, stick it in the fridge for a bit, and then also do that. Or some wet tea bags can do the same, put in the fridge for 15 minutes, or cucumbers, just like the stereotypical spa day with cucumbers on your eyes. But yeah, I saw, I didn't notice a lot of decrease in the puffiness under my eyes. Yeah, but, but what I did notice it, it looks almost to me like this looks a little less red. Like it's still pink, but a little less red. That's still there. And even this one here, looks a little less angry. It hurts less. Like this hurts less now because this was actually kind of painful, but it hurts less, which is good. My skin still feels cold. This is incredible. First impression wise, I love the cooling effect. I think this could be really refreshing for the summer. The scent is beautiful. When I scented it, when I scented it, 
<laughs> when I smelled it through the package, it reminded me almost immediately. The first thought I had was the belief line. It smells really light and fresh. But when I applied it to my face, there's a bit of more of an earthiness to it, which was still really, really nice and pleasant. It stayed on my face. I can just get a little whiff of it right now, but it doesn't feel like it's like a fragrance. It's just, it smells very natural, which is nice. The other thing is that I think for a cooling mask, this thing is fantastic for hydration. My skin feels nice and dewy. It doesn't feel sticky, but it feels very dewy very moisturized, very dewy, which is nice. For daytime, I feel like this is almost probably enough moisturization for myself. And I would just need to put on some sunscreen and that's it. I'll probably do some eye cream just because I didn't put any of the product like on my eye area. So I will do some eye cream. Now, if you have very dry skin, you might want to also put on a moisturizer on top of this if you're planning on doing this during the day. However, I'm, I'm happy with it. It works for my skin. The products on my hands, I do feel something. It's not sticky, but I definitely feel that there's something there. But there's also layers upon dried layers of it on my hands. But on my face, it feels really good. I'm going to probably just stick on some makeup and see how it lays on top of that. But overall, I'm very happy with it. This will probably be a rebuy product for me as well because I do feel that this hurts less this feels a little bit less angry as well. And my forehead looks to me less red and irritated. The camera never picks it up exactly how I see it in my mirror, but it definitely does look a little less red and irritated. I think also it kind of plumped up the dry spots on my forehead too a little bit because the lines look a little bit less there. The texture of the mask itself. This I found it to be thicker than the real nature one that I tried, but th thinner than like, um, I don't know if I, I don't think I ever published this one, but I tried a Silcott one because that was a brand that Avon was considering carrying too. We never did, but it's thinner than that. So it was, it's a very interesting, it's kind of like cross between a cloth and a sheet, like a piece of, like a papery tissue sheet. So you can see that there are definitely more woven fibers, right? But the material, it's clung to my face beautifully well, better than the, the real nature one. So I do think that this is a little bit more high quality than, than the real nature one, but I really liked the tea tree oil one. I don't know, I'll probably end up going back and forth or when something else do tries, I'll try that too. I don't know guys, but that's, that's, that's my two cents worth. So guys, that's it for this video. If you are interested in getting your hands on one of these beauties here, make sure you go to the e-store link down in the description box below. And while you're there, take a peek at that join Avon button. If at any time at all, you thought to yourself, wow, Jess is having so much fun. How do I get in on that action? Click that link, click that join email button and get your business up and running in just a few minutes. Once you get started, you can earn from commissions generated from your sales coast to coast all across Canada with an easy click of a button. If you have any questions before you get started, you can reach out to me via Instagram or Facebook or I think I now have a community center on, uh, on here on YouTube. You can check that out too. Don't really know how that works yet. I'm still learning, guys. If you're new to this channel, hit that subscribe button as well as that little bell icon beside it so you never miss a video notification. I have new videos up every single week. And of course, you never want to miss one of those. I love you guys. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.